Hello there, Eroner here, and today I will want to show you how to do a swap charge, show you what it is and what's the very good results out of it, and in very last step I will show you also how to prevent such tactic. So, to show you with just um, pencil, pen and pencil, let's say enemy has a front line, we have also front line and some chargers in reserve. So our goal is to, to charge with our front line. So there will be a, a two front lines fighting each other. Then we will pull back our front line and with our chargers in reserve we are going to charge them. And in this replay you will see how much difference does it make and how important is it doing in the Troy. So uh, the very first step is that I will bring uh, Darden and Rebels. They will be just fighting and most likely they are going to lose. But they are here to eat enemy charge. Enemy solid frontline armored spearmen. And I will just stop right here. How to execute swap charge is very simple. Uh, you can start with the charger when you have enough distance. You just right click and that's it. Then our uh, next step is to select your front lines and right click behind to go back. So same thing we are going to do here. We are charging and very important detail enemy is chasing our rebel and our rebels are going behind sworn fighters so enemy armored spearman is not charging and we are going to very nicely let's show you let me show you the number of kills we are going we already have three four kills just on very start enemies does not have any charge bonus we do So, and because enemy is uh, tasked to fight the rebels, they will try to chase them and usually heavier unit is able to push through your unit. So this, this can happen. And that's perfect for you to bring them back. So the result will be very devastating. Look at the six defense. They are going to die very quickly. And what happened on this other side? Enemy armored spearman was not chasing our rebels. And it is because of the guard mode option. In in every of your unit you can toggle the guard mode. They will hold they will not chase any enemies at all cost. That way uh, they are able to brace enemy charge and receive less damage. And why you should use swap charge? Because of look at the HP difference. Uh, I have dealt, dealt a lot of damage, a lot of kills very easily. So I will be able to finish off this armored spearman. Yes, one is routing, Your warriors are losing the next one is routing as well. Uh, to counter this swap charge, yes, you should use the guard mode. And when I speed this up, you will see that armored spearmen not just only uh, survive, they are going to win this battle. They, they were not blindly chasing. They were not uh, counter-charged. 
they were just nicely bracing and holding ground. Have you seen this? Uh, this unit was fighting somewhere here, but, but they came back. They are going back to hold their original ground. And that's how to uh, prevent or counter the enemy swap charge. For the campaigns, you really want to use them because enemy AI is not the holding ground. So, that would be it. I hope this is helpful for you and see you later.